Hello, I'm back, Looter FM, with another episode of the So Show You've Only Saved. First of all, this is not a So Show shirt, this is a Dortmund shirt, but it's a very nice shirt. 2020-2021 uh, cut shirt that they wore. It's uh, different to the home shirt that they wore. Um, but yeah, it's a nice shirt. I got it from I got it one of my mystery boxes that you can uh, watch the video of on my YouTube channel. So there you go, nice little linkage going on there. Right. Um, we've got three games left of our first season of League 1. We are currently six in the league. We were as high as second at one point last episode. The other teams are just, they keep, basically the other teams are just, out. when we're winning, they're winning. And when and then the odd game we lose, they win. It, they're just better than us. But if I say, if, if we've got three games left, we could potentially be as high as second in the league. Um, so my aim in this episode is to try and make sure we win every game and get into at least the top four. Um, hopefully, but we'll see how it goes. So like I said, this episode is not going to be very long because of the fact there's only three games left. So it'll be a, short, a shorter episode. And then the next episode will be me basically fast forwarding into the next season. And we'll just see how it goes from there. But anyway, I'll be back in a sec with the first game of the episode. Right, so here we go. Here we go. We've got Goon Gump in the uh, first game of the episode. Um, I'm going to leave the team as is, even though Izanga's playing. I don't particularly want him playing, but we'll just let the assistant manager do his thing. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, we're as we're currently like fifth or sixth in the league at the moment. There you go, LeBron. First goal of the game after four minutes. Lovely header. Second, I think it is. Fourth goal of the season, from what I just saw on the screen. Does that make a difference? Let's have a look at. So we've got to look at Lens, Marseille, Nice, and Monaco. I don't think oh, any of them teams are playing, unfortunately. Thierry, Mugen, Lebron. I've become really attached to these lads, so I think this is the closest thing I'm going to get to my favourite ever save I ever did on Football Manager when I was Coventry City many many seasons ago uh, many many years ago sorry so this is definitely my favourite save of FM24 let's have a look, Lens are winning they're the only team, oh Monaco's winning so we just need to keep an eye on Monaco and Lens but they're both winning convincingly so but we're winning 2 0 as well. Um, I'll put it back on the league table in a second, actually. Izanga with the corner, headed out. Didot with the shot. Yeah, it makes no difference with us winning. We really need. Look at, look at the margins here. One point separating us from third, and then three points separating us right from second. we just got to keep winning and hope for the other teams to slip up. Yeah, go on, Didot. Eighth goal of the season for him. Nice to see him scoring. 3-0 after 32 minutes played. Theo. Oh, good save, pop out. Nice to see he's concentrating even though we're winning 3-0. To do with Monaco losing, to be honest, helping us out. At least we'd be fifth then. Paisley, Patricio, Mugen, good ball. Oh, what a shot. What a goal by Angeli. 11th goal of the season for him. He's having a great season. It's probably a good idea to get as many goals as possible because if all these teams are equal on points, then they go by goal difference. Come 
Come on then. Come on then. It's all right, Baxter wants to get up. Come on then. Oh, I'm all sodgy then. He, 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 he gives me the impression of... <laughs> just panicked his head on the table. There you go. Hello. Hello. Yes, hello. 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 Yes, you don't need to lick me. Come on. There you go. I'm going to say hello to the people on the camera. Hello, I'm Baxter the dog. <laughs> yes, hello. Hello, I'll give your belly rub. Yes, I'll give your belly rub. Right, then, down you go. There you go, good boy. Right, sorry about that. Four nil win. Despite the win, we're still six. Holiday for six days, and we'll just wait for this because it doesn't take very long a couple of seconds at the most. Two, well, one, and we are mm, maybe not. Come on, there we go, good to go. go through these news items praise a few players I wouldn't normally um, bother letting you lot watch this because I just don't see it being very entertaining um, but because we're only got three games left I thought I'd do this to make the episode a little bit more bulkier because it wouldn't, it'd probably be like less than 20 minutes if I don't do this. So, we'll just see how it goes here. Right, ease expectations, always do that. Praise Paisley for his training. Saving the game. So, we've got two games left. We've got Lille away now. They're only slightly behind us in the league. They're seventh. So if they beat us, they probably go past us. We'll be down to seventh. We might only just scrape getting into Europe at this rate. Actually, we're definitely going to get into Europe, I think, because if these are the European places, there's two games left. We're definitely going to get European football, but um, we're not going to get... I don't think we're going to get Champions League football, but we might. You never know. Marseille need to lose both of their games, though. So probably going to aim for Europa... Which aren't too bad considering. Eventually we'll get in the top four. I reckon next year we will. Right, I'll leave Izanga on the right wing. We won last time, so hopefully we'll win again this game. I'm really enjoying the um, Coventry Nostalgia 2007-2008 database save. I've just signed 41-year-old. Teddy Sheringham for my Coventry team who comes, and Darren Anderton, they both come into it in um, January. Mostly signed them just because the fact that they, they were, I was able to sign them. I tried other strikers like An Andrew Cole, Dwight York, but they didn't want to come to me. Um, Robbie Fowler I tried, John uh, Jimmy Floyd Hasselbank I tried, and none of them wanted to come to me. Um, I, I want to try and bring back Dion Dublin, to be honest, back to Coventry as well. But we'll see. But yeah, that's on my YouTube channel as well if you want to give it a watch. The latest episode with me signing Sheringham is on there. I'm doing pretty good actually, to be honest, as well on that save. 1-1. Uh, David Ozo. Ozo. Where's he from? I think he's... Oh no, he's Spanish. I was thinking of somebody else. Oh yeah, Crystal Palace, yeah. Thought his name was familiar. He was linked with Man United in real life uh, for a bit at some point last season or the season before. Right, Bastian's not playing well, which concerns me. Good. Uh, I was that good defensive play there, but yeah, we got it back. Come on. Ugh, that was poor, poor defense. 
spending there. Hopefully VAR will come to our rescue. No, goal dislike, thank God. Right, 1-1. One, one. Oh, Terry. Still 1-1, one, one, but uh, Lille seems to be coming into the game, but we've, we've got the ball. You never know. Izanga gives it to Angeli. Paisley with the overtop ball. Look at the space Bastian's got. I don't know what he's doing here. That was poor. Right, and he's coming off. Um, we actually, I don't think we've got anybody that can come on for him. No, he'll have to stay on. He'll have to come off eventually, but I'm trying to figure out in my head while I'm waiting for this highlight to finish. Might have to put Paisley's left back, I suppose. Oh, go on. Yeah! 2-1. Right. Time to take off him. Who can we put on for? Apparently we can put you on. That's not true. That's a lie. But we can do that. Two one. We're still six, which is very frustrating when you're winning and you still can't get higher up the league. We're literally there's one point behind us and the other teams now. It will come down to the last game of the season by the looks of it, and we just got to hope and pray that the other teams, um, that the other teams falter a bit and the pressure gets to them. But either way, even if we get like a six or seven place, well, we're gonna we're guaranteed if we win this game, we're guaranteed guaranteed to get at least six place finish. So I think for the first season in league on that is really good, um, and it also gives us chance to improve next season. I mean, look at that, we're literally one point behind. We're only three points behind second place. Right, Angeli needs to come off. Put on the lock, and then Patricio needs to come off, so we'll just have to put Zerbo in there. He is versatile, Zerbo. He'll do the job, what needs to be done, I think. Oh, great. Zerbo, who's just come off, has already been told he needs to come off. Well, no, that's not happening. Yeah, let's just see this game out now. I'm hoping for a defensive cock up here. Didn't happen. No, I don't want him to equalise here. Good defensive clearance there. Izanga gives it to. No, no, it doesn't matter. Um, Mugen. Pelias, three versus two here. Come on, let's make a van. Take a. Oh, geez, this, this is why you're not here at the club anymore, Izanga. Your decision making is terrible. We have three versus two there. You should have passed it into the box. If they equalise now, I'm going to be so angry at his anger. Good save. Thank God for Coppo. Right, 2-1. Let's see the game. Oh. Here we go. Oh my god, I thought it was going to be a penalty then. Come on. That's offside. That's offside. Offside. Come on, that's offside. How is that not offside? <sighs> Sorry for swearing. I'm so annoyed right now. That was clearly offside. Well, we can still get Fifth, fourth, or third, but we've got to hope that the other teams lose, which ain't going to happen, is it? Ah, oh, such a shame. Right at the end as well. But, you know, like I said, FM, they just don't want you to win. 
right, it's holiday the six days to play the last game of the season against Wrens. Wrens are currently 14, so you never know, we might win. Thank God for my super quick gaming laptop. Right, did Otis himself getting down? I think he wants a new contract. Okay, let's offer you a new contract. Right, new contract offered. Okay, sorry about this, everyone. This is why I don't show you this because of the cock ups I make when I'm tapping away. Um, I have like a mod version of. Cerebral palsy, um, and a thing called ataxia that affects my hand and eye coordination. So, yeah, there you go. We've got better youth facilities. Let's have a look at the facilities now. So, we've got um, top corporate facilities, perfect pitch, state of the art training in facilities, superb youth facilities, exceptional co academy coach, and exceptional youth recruitment, and a 20,000 stadium. So, I don't think we can improve anything on the um, I don't think we can improve anything on the facility side now. We can ask for a new stadium eventually, but that's a shame about our uh, second team getting relegated. Right, let's see where let's see the competition. Let's have a look. Right, so we're six. We've got one game left in the season. Monaco, Nice, and Marseille are above us. If we win, and they all lose. Then we will be higher than them because of the goal difference that we've got. But like I said, that's a big ask. Right, so we've got Nice who are playing Lens. So Lens are second, so they might do us a favour. Leon are always a strong team, even though they're not doing very well this season. So Monaco will have a tough task ahead of them. Who's Marseille playing? Marseille are playing Troy, so that's an easy win for them. Oh, no, 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 no. Troy's are eight, so. Stand corrected. Right then. Last game of the season. Last game of the uh, of his career with Socho for Izanga. Let's hope he goes out with a a a, a winning good winning bleh, good winning performance. He's already got a seven point one. We've only played seven minutes, so there you go. Right. Let's have a, let's click on. No, it's not what I want. See, my khaki hands. Right, there we go. So, Lille's losing, which is good for us. Monaco are drawing, which is good for us. We'll have a look at the other scores as they go in. We need to win this game, though. Good, there you go. Go on, Didot. Run, 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 run. Keep going, keep going. Keep going. Oh, what was the point in that if you're just going to lose the ball? You just knackered yourself out. And now they're going to score. Oh, maybe not. Oh, maybe so. Goal. They are toying with us. I thought they were going to... As I was say, I felt like they were toying with us there. Good <laughs> defensive play here. So, yeah, 1-1 one, one in the Monaco game still. Lilla losing... Nil nil in the Marseille game. Is it Nice we're gonna keep it on it? Yeah, Nice are losing, so that's good. That is good for us. They're losing two nil. Monaco's winning though. Balls. Three one now. Ah, um, Pierce. Ah, uh, Lil's just equalised as well. Good defensive inter, 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 inter. Oh, I don't know what I was thinking of. Tackle. We'll just say tackle. Go on. Yes. Oh, of course VAR comes to be the villain. The referees want a bit of attention. Bless them. Ah. Oh. Right, half time. Let's demand a bit more. Uh, let's have a look at the scores. PSG's beating Lille. Uh, Monaco's winning. Nice are losing. 
Marseille are drawing. Where are we in the league then? We're still six. So we need to win this game, I think. If we win this game and the other scores stay the same, we'll be slightly ahead of one or two teams, I think. Angeli with the corner, headed out. Lebrun with the ball now. Loses it. Oh no, regains it. We've got, we've, got quite, we've got a couple of yellow cards on the pitch as well, which is worrying. I don't know what we're doing here. Did up. Bastian all the way across. Would have been probably better somebody in the box. Izanga. That, this, you, you, you put me off, Izanga. I'm sorry, but no. That was just ridiculous. You watch your score now. Go on, Patricio. Right, still nil nil. Monaco's still winning. Lille is still losing. Straighten the goalkeeper's hands. I hate that corner. I swear, ninety percent of the time, the in, the in swinging ones go straight into goalkeeper's hands. Right, Bastian, Angeli, is it the Dido? Mugen. Pinto with the ball. Crosses it in. Oh, come on. We're getting closer. We are getting closer. Right. Let's have a look. Marseille still drawing. Nice are losing 2 0 now. Monaco's winning though. Lille's losing. We really need to get a goal here. Let's try and encourage them. Let's try and be a little bit nicer to them. They don't need to come off. The lock can come on for him. Oh, no, it won't. We'll take off moving because he's knackered. Oh, Marseille winning, damn it. it bloody had to be Greenwood as well, didn't it? Oh, come on. <sighs> chance after chance in this game. 18 shots, 6 on target, 2.23 XG, and we still haven't scored. Nah. And that's that bit of a rubbish end of the season here. Where do we end up? So we've managed to get What's that? I think that's um, Europa Conference League, isn't it? It's the one just below Europa League. Yeah, Europa League. So we've got European football. So that's pretty good. Um, in our first season, so we've got a lot. We've got to give. We've got to give the lads a lot of credit. Fair play to them. Uh, Monin's out for up to three months. Yeah, qualified for the Europa Conference League. There you go. So overall, it was a really good season. We've got some decent prize money. In there, nice boost to the finances. Can I do anything to improve anything? Nope, because it's all maxed out. So probably ask for more staff, but they probably won't give it me. Um, so yeah, let's have a quick look at the yeah. So player stats. So we had Kofi was the main man up front with twenty six goals for the season, seven point two x g. Uh, sorry, seven point two average rating, seven point two two average rating. Sorry, best player for average rating overall was Bastian. Had a great season, 8 assists, 4 goals, 7.37 um, average rating. Most assists was William, William Pinto with 11 assists. He got 1 goal, 7.25 average rating. And then we'll just have a general look at the squad now. Uh, was it selection info? That's it. So here we go, appearances. So Kofi made the most appearances by the looks of it. Or did he? Yeah, he did, yeah. Um, yeah, so overall, as you can see on the screen here, not too bad. Um, why is he unhappy? I've already offered you a new contract. Unless, is he waiting? I was waiting, that's why. Waiting for him to accept it. We've got Espanyol after Pinto. Obviously, Isanga's going to Birmingham. Um, that's about it, really, on that side. Right then. So, on that note, I'm going to leave you to it. And then I'll, uh, I'll be back tomorrow with the start of a brand new season so all the best and i'll speak to you soon bye